Hello, it's your boy Nefarious UT coming at you with another video. Now, as I said, technically today. Yeah, I know I fucked up the recording shit. Fucking rendering of that shit was way too much. Anyway, as I said, technically today, I was going to be recording some Brawlhalla. So, here we are. Now, by no means is this a full representation of my skill set. Just throwing that out there in the beginning. I think I play better than this most of the time. But, um, clearly not today. Anyway, so, I'm going to be playing... So, for this tournament that's literally tomorrow, mostly going to be playing um, Sentinel because as the character I'm most familiar with, I also do sometimes occasionally play as Ember when I'm just getting the shit beaten out of me and I want to change up because Lord knows that happens way too fucking much, but yeah. So, I'm not going to lie, I did start off pretty good this game. I, I mean, this set video. I just start off pretty good. Now, full disclosure, played some prior games before this where I was getting my ass beat senseless, but hey, that's not important here. What's important is the recording. <laughs> so, I did play some games earlier today, and I was getting shit on. So, you know, typical, uh, typical, uh, gameplay for me. Typical gameplay. But yeah, so, I'm playing Sentinel. Because well, he's my best character, period. Like, that's just a fact. Uh, some people may watch my gameplay and be like, Oh, the fair, you're just spamming the whole fucking time. Be like, no. Some of my moves are actually calculated. Other times you might be correct. But most of the time they're pretty calculated. Now, I won't lie, I was, uh, I, I was on a little bit of a streak in this video, you know what I'm saying? I was, I was beating a good number of people. And then I, then I started playing people that were actually decent at the game, and that's when the shit went sideways. You know, I was just getting beaten the fuck out of. Like, niggas was really violating my whole being. For no type of reason. But hey, what can you do? They're just better than me. <laughs> that's just what the fuck happens. When you're not the best at something, and then you play people that are probably better than you, what the fuck do you expect to happen? It's just like fucking <laughs> the top team in any fucking sports league playing like one of the worst teams. You know what the fuck's about to be the case. I mean, I'm not saying I'm the worst. No means my son. I'm probably, I like to believe that I'm just a bit below me. Just a bit. Now, some people may be like, yeah, that's a bunch of bullshit. You're, you're fucking ass. But I believe. That's, that's, what, that's what's important here. I believe just a bit below me but hey we all can't be fucking winners apparently but yeah so this first game if it even still is the first game i can't fucking remember these games i ain't gonna lie they start to just fucking blend together they start to fold together like i'll know that i win or some shit but other than that them bitches just fold like one game i'll be like oh yeah this this took place then and, and it didn't and I'll just be shit. And I'll be shit out of luck. But hey, we'll figure it out, you know what I'm saying? We'll figure it out. I'm like four minutes into this recording, give or take. So let's go to four minutes. Oh, I'm playing gold bar. Holy shit. Let's go. I think I won this game. If I remember correctly, I won this game. Maybe I won this game. Probably not. Oh no, I did win this game. Let's fucking go. Now see, this, this is what I'm talking about. This is why I believe that I am just a smidge under me. Just a smidge. Like, you see me play against people that are actually good. You'll be like, damn, you're fucking ass, bro. You're just shit. But hey, we do big things. Now, I believe this is the part. Who am I playing next? Shit. Yeah, I'm playing cross. So basically, if I remember right, this is when Three, shit just two, falls sideways, one, like roll. just a bit. Like if I remember correctly, this is when shit goes sideways. This is entirely when shit goes sideways. Like so much, in fact, that like 
Honestly, I can't remember some of these games. Like, legitimately, this shit's ass sometimes. I'll be sitting here just... Now, this is not a good demonstration of my skills right now. You see what the fuck Cross is doing to me. Shit to that. Honestly, I'm not gonna hold y'all. Some of the worst weapons I play against are like fucking Lance. Well, not really Lance anymore. I like the thing I figured out, Lance. But then again, who the fuck knows? But blasters. And fucking gauntlets are shit. Like, honest to God, I fucking hate people that play with gauntlets. Like, entirely. Like, I hate them to the core of my being. Like, they are fucking shit for that. Like, gauntlets are just AIDS. For no reason. Just not. They're just AIDS because they exist. Now, some of you guys who actually play this game, or just generally think they're better than me, which is probably not, um, might be watching this and being like, holy shit, this guy is so easy to beat, like, what are you doing, you're just going into his traps, and his fucking baits, and I'll just be, this, this is my rebuttal then, Let, let's see here, so, this man, well, for starters, I mean, this isn't really an excuse. This is just shit I deal with on the regular. But, like, there will be times when just... I'll hit... I'll put it something in the game. Like, I'll input something. And then that shit just won't happen. Now, sometimes it does work out for me. I'm not gonna lie. Sometimes it does work out. But most of the time, that shit fucks me. Now, I'm not saying this is an excuse. I'm just stating a fact. That sometimes shit doesn't go my way. Because of inputs. But... Also, it's like, some of these people just, they just know what the fuck they're doing. Like, I I don't have that level of experience yet, to where I just know, oh, this guy, he's going to do this, that, and whatnot, and that. But it's like, I'm not fucking there yet. Maybe one day I'll be there, but I ain't there yet. Oh, shit. I did it. Damn, I'm trying to remember. Was there another cross I got beat by in this game? Probably. Now, this video? Probably. I don't remember if it exactly was a cross. I know someone beat the fuck out of me. Well, actually, I know someone beat the fuck out of me. That's, that's not even a debate. Yeah, I don't remember. I See, the problem is here, I played two Kayas back to back. So I don't remember if I beat the first one and lost the second one or, or lost the first one and beat the second one. Honestly, I might have fucked around and lost to both of them. Watching this back, I feel like shit. Like, honest to God, this shit's sad to watch. Cause she's kind of like, I'm not gonna say I'm Mr. Creative. Like, I change up my moves all the fucking time, but like. When you watch certain people play, it's just like, holy fuck. Like, I won't lie, there have been some games where I just only do the same fucking- Well, not only the same move, but I just do mainly the same move. Like, there's some games where I do that. Like, just watching that beginning, holy fuck. She was doing the same shit, like, over and over again. I'm also mad that I didn't fucking kill right there on the first one. Like, I didn't need to do a second one. That bitch should have died. But I digress. You know, that's, that's just what what it is. Like, now you see, I got it. Well, I almost had her in a loop, but hey. Like you see, her go-to is literally that slide um, owl bullshit, fucking steam ass owl bullshit. Now I was hoping I would have got her with, cause that's what my go-to is whenever they're on the edge. I either want to go for the ground pound lightning attack or that. In case they over jump me, so I can just sweep them out. But like, even in the last game, you'll see that like one of my main weaknesses is 100% edge, and just doing moves unnecessarily for no type of reason. Like, you see how much ground pounding I just did there. Like I probably could have killed her there if I didn't just keep ground pounding and just going up using my up signature. Like if I just didn't do that, I probably would have been fucked. But you know what? I said fuck that. I know what I'm doing, and I'm smart. So, 
I know what what's up. And like honestly, some of these people that beat the shit out of me, it's probably because they just read me. Like they just see how the fuck I play and they're like, yeah, I can fucking beat this nigga. And I don't really blame them. <laughs> like, I swear, some games I'll literally play them first. Yep, yeah, this is I fucking knew it. This was the one I lost. <laughs> but yeah, some of these niggas that I'll play, like, it'll just be. Oh. I think I know what I'm doing. Like, they'll just give me their first fucking stock, and I'll think, oh shit, I'm the shit right now. You see that? They forked over their stock. Which means that I'm gonna fucking win again. But no, but fucking no. That's not how that shit goes. Instead, I'm sitting in there Three, mad two, at the fucking one, world like oh. this nigga just I beat this nigga the first time and then all of a sudden this nigga comes out like ha I'm god nigga ha we got your ass unlocked now. But luckily for me that isn't the case with this guy. I'm, I'm almost entirely yeah, this guy didn't know what the fuck she was doing the whole game. Like, she legitimately was just there. She was just like, you know what? I'm not here to win. I'm just not. And I was perfectly okay with that. Because you need games like this. You need the ego boost game. <laughs> Which is exactly what I'm about to call this game. Because that's what this is. An ego boost game. Like, I swear, this game Brawl Hall is like, ha, huh, shit. This nigga is ready to play. He's ready to be done. 100%. He is ready to be done. And then they'll give me a game like this where it's like, no shit. This, this is why I'm at the level I'm at. Because I get games like this. <laughs> where the person I'm playing is just... I don't want to say they're below me in skill level, but like... Some of these games I'll be playing, there's like people that I just see where it's like... I don't understand how they got to this point. Like, at all. Now... Maybe it's because certain characters are just weak to certain characters. Like, I'm not gonna lie, there are some characters where it's just like, yeah, you're about to get just fucked. And you're just gonna have to accept that. Especially if the person knows how to play a character. Like, I won't lie. Like, if I play a Mordek, and they actually know what the hell they're doing, no, oh, that's probably a fucking rap. Because them niggas, they just fuck me up, like, legitimately. Fucking Mordex, I don't even know who the hell came up with the concept of Mordex, but them niggas said, I don't want anyone to feel like joy. I fucking hate Mordex with a passion. Like, holy fuck. He just ruins games for me. Legitimately. Like, I see him pop up and I'm just like, fuck sake. Now, I don't remember who I play after this guy, because at this point, you should already know that I fucking won this game. Like, I'm sorry, two to one. Now, I won't lie, there have been some games I've almost blown. But this is not one of them. Now, it may look like I'm about to blow this game, but I didn't. I didn't do that. Not yet. I'm pretty sure I blew a game somewhere in here already. I'm trying to remember who else I played. Player one wins. Like, legitimately, this. I don't want to say this game. Right here was too easy. Like, I don't like the fucking flip flop bullshit that this game puts on. Like, there will be games I play where I legitimately have to earn my fucking win. I will have to, like, claw tooth and fucking nail to hopefully scrape by and get a win. But then there's games like fucking Kai where it's just like, oh. You wanted to win? Well, here you go. Let me fucking hand you this shit on a silver platter. Now, this Bodevar game, I'm almost entirely sure I just got vi Yeah, I got violated this game. This nigga violated me. Like, see how I just got this Ego Boost game with the Kaya, and then all of a sudden they hand me this nigga. Like, I ain't gonna lie. In the beginning of the game, I was thinking, like, I'm landing these hits. He's not hitting me. I was thinking, oh, shit. I'm about to fuck around and beat this guy. Who clearly has... De he definitely had more skill than me. I mean, it just gets demonstrated time and time again in this game. And I'm not gonna lie, fighting games were never my game. They're just not. Talk to anybody that fucking knows me. Fighting games are not my shit. Like, I'm, I'm a strategy game person. Heart, heart and fucking heart. Like, you play me in some shit that involves, like, 
strategy or something like that, I will genuinely do better. Like fighting games, I don't know what it is about fighting games, I'm just not good at them. Like, I don't know if it's that I have to memorize buttons or make, like, fucking lightning fast reads, but it's just like, shit is just not good. I don't know why that's the case, but it just is. Now, off the side note, I should not have gotten hit by the fucking bear claw. That, that was some bullshit. Now, maybe you guys fucking disagree, but I don't think I should have been. Now, see, I fucked up there. He should already die. Legitimately, he should, he should be dead. He should be a fucking <laughs> But this nigga's just better than me. He, he knows how I play. That's just what it is. Like, when, you, when you're when you fighting someone who just knows how you play, it's just kind of dead. It's just kind of dead. That's just how it is. Like, legitimately, that shit's fucking dead for no type of reason. Like, you see this, man. He is just fucking. Like, I'm getting bent over as he just rolls around the map talking about, yeah. I own you. Like, these are the type of people I hate playing with. It's like, it's cool if you're better than me. I just don't want you to see you dancing around the fucking map, bro. That's not what I want. Like, yeah, you could be better than I'm on some shit like that, but it's like, at the end of the day, I, I play this game to have fun. Or at least I tell myself that a lot. But some of these people just make me want to stop playing games. Like, legitimately. Like, they're just like, you know what? Fuck you. Son. I want you to feel bad. Like, damn. Who the fuck pissed in your mouth this morning for you to be this pissed off at me? And taunt me like I ain't shit. Who, who fucking shit in your cereal this morning? Because those are the people you should be fucking pissed with. Not, not me. I get fuck all of you. <laughs> I just happen to get in the damn game with you. And then this nigga had the nerve to say GG like nigga. We all know that wasn't a good game. <laughs> you fucked me. You played me like a damn fiddle. Man, you just said. I know all the right fucking chords to hit. Oh now this game. Holy fuck. Yo. I, I think I legitimately had two back to back Hattori games in this shit as well. I'm trying to remember who else I lost. I know I lost it right here. This is just a fact. Like, bruh, I play Hattori's, I know what the hell they're doing. I shouldn't even say that. I was just playing like shit this game. I'm not even gonna hold you, I was just playing like shit. <laughs> it was not entirely that she was just a better player than me. I was just playing like ass. Like, I, I recognized the patterns of what the fuck was going on, and I just said fuck the patterns. I didn't even try to avoid that. Like, you see how often I'm just going into her shit? Like, she's charging that shit up in a second. And I'm just running into that shit like fucking Rambo. Like, <laughs> like watching this shit back, it's like, maybe if I would have played with any sort of common sense, I'd like, maybe. I mean, don't get me wrong, her timing was also fucking on me. Like, the, like, I wish I had that level of skill to where I could just... Oh, I know exactly where the fuck he's going, and I'm just gonna wait, like, not even wait, like, instantly do the move, like, I'm gonna put myself in the best position possible to make sure he fucking dies, like, look at this, this shit's 3-1, the match is damn near just started, it's already 3-1, like, bro, I'm, this is like playing someone, like, there was this one time when I was playing, one of these, uh, one of my friends, family friends, and like chess. Now, I ain't gonna lie, I went to that shit big headed as fuck. I'm like, I'm that nigga in chess. Now, I'm really not that nigga in chess, but I like to believe I am. So I go into this game big headed as fuck. Nigga, I lost in like 10, 15 moves at the most. I don't just sit there stunned. Like, some niggas literally in fighting games are playing on two different levels. Like, I may be playing you, but you're not playing me. You're playing a whole nother level of game. Like, we are not on the same level. You're above me. You're playing on some other shit. Now, this is when I switch over to Ember. Because I was, I'm not going to lie, after that game, I was fucking heated. And I was pissed. I was, I was sitting there like, you fucking serious? Like, hindsight, looking back at this shit, I should, really shouldn't have been mad. I fucking lost that game. I did that shit to myself. Now, this game right here, holy fuck. 
Three, Nick, two, I one, see. Brawl. I don't want to keep saying that whenever I play people that actually know what the fuck they're doing, they just beat me. It's just that I'm not gonna lie. I play a predictable type of game. No. Do I believe there's something wrong with that? No. I just have to accept reality and the fact that I'm not always gonna fucking win because most people in this game are gonna be like, "Oh, you play predictable shit. I know exactly what the fuck you're gonna do, when you're gonna do it, and how you're gonna do it." It's like. I don't need that type of bullshit, like, for real, for real, I don't need it, like, I would much rather play against people that play similarly to me, now, I know that's not gonna happen, but I want that, cause these type of people, where they just, like, they just know, I'm sitting there like, damn, what type of bullshit is you on, like, what the hell were you doing, like, did you just, did you get filmed with me somehow, like, did you just know? Like, I don't know how people just know how other people play like this, but it's kind of crazy. Like, I get there's some people in the world that just like they see someone do something once, or like they play like one. Like, say for instance, you're playing Smash Bros. And there's niggas that I know that you play them, they they might lose one stock off rip, but then they pick up how the fuck you're playing, and then they just completely decimate you the rest of the game. It's like I can't, I don't have that level of. Uh, I don't know if it's mental capacity. It's not mental capacity. It's just, I don't have that level of... I don't want to say awareness in fighting games, but it's just like... Shit like that is like not easy for me. Like, if I'm playing a strategy game, maybe then I'll pick up shit quicker because it's like... Yeah, not everything comes with so fast paced. I don't have to think on the spot and shit like that. I can actually take time, construct things the way I want to, and things like that. But fighting games is like, nigga, you're just in the shit. Like, them niggas whip your ass into the fire and say, go ahead, burn, bitch. <laughs> but anyway, I guess this is the fucking end of the video. Now, after I lost this game, I was like, yeah, I'm fucking done. Which is what I'm done with right now, this video. Peace.